everybody, welcome to GDPG, and we are back with more of the Curious Expedition, but not just what you've already seen, no. There have been, I think, four updates since. Four updates? Yeah, oh my god, I've, there's going to be so much new shit. Um, this, is, this is Alpha Update 20, the Halloween update. We're still in Alpha? Oh. I thought you told me we were in full release. No, no. Um, so the reason we wanted to do this one was because it's the Halloween... Uh, update and there is something in it that you will like quite a bit. All right, fair enough. At least I think. Um, so let's just jump in into a new game and you'll see it right off the bat. Oh so my there's god. So there's a new character. Wait, new character? Uh, he's already unlocked. Finish the game rank three plus with two fully level up characters. He's not fully. He, he's not unlocked. You mean he's unlocked for like the for like when, the update? Maybe, maybe that's another. We new haven't character. unlocked him. Go go to that fourth one on the bottom row. This one or this one? That one. HP Lovecraft! <laughs> awesome! And guess what he starts with? Cosmic indifference improves usage of the Necronomicon! Yes! <laughs> Wait, what is this shit? Hang on, metal cube, a small cube with you know. shiny metallic material. You, st you start with three? I, I was playing through this a little bit, they w randomly disappear. I don't know why. That maybe it was from using the Necronomicon? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Wait, he starts with a Necronomicon, a Scottish soldier, and a British soldier. It's <laughs> like they were watching. <laughs> That's amazing. Wait, so this isn't this isn't the new guy then? There there actually might be some other new characters, there, but there, HP Lovecraft right. was the one I was so excited about. So there have about. to be at least two new characters, because I remember, th I remember th this right here is clearly, um, uh, uh, what's his face? Uh... Alistair Crowley, and mm. he used to be right here, which means there's two new characters, and I don't remember this mm. okay. being a, a, a line there. Um, well, there have been four updates. The only reason I knew H.P. Lovecraft was in, in this was because they mentioned it in their update video. Okay, for this release, fair so. enough, fair enough. All right, well, uh, let's uh, let's try H.P. Lovecraft, because uh, 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 Chris and I have a, a bit of a history with H.P. Lovecraft. <laughs> uh, I, I run uh, role-playing games, and we... Seven years ago, when we first started being friends, it was running the Call of Cthulhu. That was that was that was a good time. Yeah, that's been... all right. That's a long time ago. That's ancient history. But let's get it started. Uh, so we are uh, welcome back. Word is that you have your uh, good chance of seeing your likeness on the statue. However, we are not the only candidate. All right, this time we are competing. We are competing against Amelia Earhart, Nikola Tesla, Charles Darwin, Ooh. and Johann Hazinga. Ooh, tough call. You know, one thing that I, I kind of wish that this game had was um, regions that you could com be in the same... You, Let me rephrase that. I wish you could be in the same region as your competitors, so you could see them moving around and, ah, and, and mess with them. So you could be on the same map as them, and you it, could see, like, it if would they change die, the dynamic. Yeah, it would change true. the dynamic of the game a lot, but I think that would be really interesting. I think that's... That's a good idea, actually. The idea of, of being able to see on the minimap your competitors sort of flunking their expeditions would be kind of comforting. They're actually, if you look to the left, the interface has changed a little bit. There is something that sort of tells us how our competitors are doing now. It does, how close your rivals are to reaching their expedition goals. So this is... This is all vertical now. It used to be horizontal. I, I actually really like it. I, I think like, it's a lot cleaner. I like cleaner. the vertical, too. Um, have they changed the magnetic mountains at all yet? I like that they display disorders on the side here. Like, they show me that the Scottish soldier is mm -hmm. clearly an it, it makes them more pronounced. It does, yeah. It makes it easier to see. The letter is also uh, of a different size sprite than it used to be. It used to be just a full sheet of paper that was the same size and shape as the Metal Cube or any of the books, such as the Necronomicon. <laughs> hmm. Left click to move single. Right click to move. On. They had some pretty cryptic things in their update too. This uh, is curious. There, there are some like dolls of children. It looked like, and they're like, "What do these do? We don't know." <laughs> I like the German accent. Sorry, machine and mensch. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they're they're German, so. All right, let's um. Oops, spilled a little bit there. Sorry. Um, let's uh let's get this expedition started. So, what do you think? Uh, head for the native village. Just try and deliver the letter. Is that right? Yeah, it's, sealed letter it's, addressed it's, to the chief of the native village. How does yeah. he know how to read? Is it in English? I mean, <laughs> just not, because they're natives doesn't mean they're uneducated. I'm just saying, like, I guess that's true. That that is that is actually true. I, 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 I mean, should be less insensitive. 
When you're living in a hut, it seems pretty unlikely okay, that you'll this know is, how to read. This is new. Uh, the, the, the organization of the way the data is presented is new. So this group looked like a group of skilled scouts. Does that mean that if I try and recruit from them, I'll get a scout guaranteed? It also doesn't give me the option blacked out like it used to give you, but it used to uh, uh, gray them out if you uh, didn't have the necessary things to sleep in the village or to mm -hmm. trade with them or all that. Instead, this time it just gives me the loot option. So I'm going to go ahead and just... Oh, really? I didn't even notice that. That. Oh, no. I ju they just gave me three food. Yeah, that that's like a peace offering. We kind of encountered that in the last Did one. We? I think. I it was don't it was that. Only when you had a really good standing though. All right. The elderly man was a compulsive talker and told us about the best sites to see in the vicinity including a holy shrine which he marked on our map our time with the natives was a delight. They remained friendly and offered us more help. See, this is I feel like see we started at standing 2. Is that a bonus for HP Lovecraft, or is that just like a difference in how the game starts? It, it might just be a difference. They didn't mention anything about ah, HP Lovecraft. Ah, here we go. This is different. See, the scouts, it gives you the names, it gives you their job. Oh. This is, it's, it's all, like, they've given oh, us yeah. more information. Before, before it was just like, recruit a scout, recruit yeah. a warrior. I think we're going to recruit an animal handler, because, uh... Well, I mean, unless you want to do... See, if you look at these two animal handlers, this guy right here has a, a red thing. He's got a negative uh, aspect. He might be a, a, a racist or a paranoid or something like that. But this guy has nothing. So if we're going to recruit an animal handler, it'll be this guy. Yeah, but we I can also wish, do the scout. I kind of wish we could scroll over it to see, but I know as soon as we scroll to the right, it's probably going to... Oh, wait! Hey! Claustrophobic. How about that? I don't know. What do you think? Claustrophobic? Do you care? Uh, I don't think claustrophobic's going to be that bad. Yeah, but at the same time, like, we might as well pick the guy who's not claustrophobic. <laughs> pick the not crazy people. Yeah, right? I don't know. What do you think? The scout or the animal handler? Well, let's do the animal handler. Animal handler it is. Improves the capacity of our uh, Miss Edwards. Oh, fuck right. yeah. We'll uh, trade with them, see what they... Ha See, they actually have a golden head this time. Yeah, they a lot of the, the towns... Um, I like that they've changed the way this works so that you can actually tell where it ends and where it doesn't yeah, end. Yeah, that, that point is, is... It's so small of a difference, but it makes a huge... Um, like, you can really tell. I think I can trade that for the golden head. What do you think? Trade all three metal cubes? We don't know what they do. Do we want to find out what they do? We kind of want to find out what they do. I, I just worry that they're a necessary component for the Necronomicon yeah. to do its crazy stuff. All right, let's 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 just take off, then. We'll, we'll see what happens. All right, so I'm going to... Ooh, they told us where the shrine is. Okay. And if you notice the little butterfly icon, it's a lot easier to see where um, insects are. I've seen it with other insects, too, not just butterflies. Really? I don't know if... Well, that's totally new, then, because I've never, I've never seen any of that. Yeah, it is new. All right, this is totally exciting. It's a brand new game, guys. Let's do this. Wait, there's a, <laughs> there's a question mark up there. I probably should have canceled traveled. Elephant graveyard? No, I'm glad I did not. Uh, I'm going to eat some of this meat... Because again, I don't know if I don't know if the the mechanics are the same anymore. Uh, this is this is all new to me. Uh, it's the scattered with the remains of long dead elephants. For some reason, hundreds of them come here to die. Form teams. Ivory is valuable, and time is well spent. All right, we just got the one. Ooh, pew. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I yeah. wonder. Oh man, I you go, buddy. I, I wonder if we have a. What are they called? A translator. translator if they translate yeah. that, oh my god, that would be awesome. <laughs> Fascinating man-made stone figure. We examine the loot. Berries. Okay, That's, so... That is a new thing, too. That is a new they, thing. They heal five sanity, um, but I think you generally find them in larger groups like that. I don't know what your capacity okay, for okay. them is, so, though. I think well, it's 20. I mean, yeah, 20 capacity for that. Uh, is it is it 10 for the mangoes, or is it 20? Because the mangoes go bad, too. Uh, it might be... The red berries don't appear to go bad over time. It says they will be removed after expedition, but it doesn't say anything about them going bad over time inside the level. Did the mangoes do that? The mangoes do. The really? mangoes do say that, yeah. Oh, I always ate them right away, so I <laughs> never gave them a chance. I'm just take everything, and that gives me a standing of zero. Okay, so I had a standing of two. Now I've got a standing of zero, but I've raided an elephant graveyard and a stone statue. Maybe they gave you a bonus of two at the start because they knew that everybody was I, doing all of this stuff. I think that's actually a really good thing because most players really? are going to experiment before yeah. they know what standing even means. For sure. You're, you're going to try before you know. All right, so I have a, I have a promotion. Ebenezer Carter, uh, Kalen McNeil, or Lobe? 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 No, I don't care. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, I think I'm going to do Ebenezer because he just seems the sanity-est. <laughs> <laughs> we'll try the shrine. 
And when we lose all of our sanity and he's the first to resort to cannibalism. Oh, for sure. You know that he will. <laughs> Thick layer of dust, that means... All right, so according to the last update, it means that there's going to be desert, and desert is dealable. So I'm just going to go ahead and take all the... Oh! Oh! Golden omelet and a... a, a I think it's a goblet. <laughs> Amulet and a goblet. Let's see. Uh, oh, did I say omelet? Maybe that's... All right, so maybe they stack with each other. No, because this is one of one. This is just, like, differentiation. I like the differentiation. It bums me out that you still can't, um... Okay, so that guy is... He's beating me. I'm gonna explore a little bit. I have a pistol. Do I want to go after... Oh. I've, I've also found that the pistol isn't as good in this update really? anymore. I think they, they toned it down. You can't... So far, I haven't found any combinations you can make with it. It just deals two damage and nothing else. Well, that sucks. I mean, I guess it makes it's, sense. It makes sense because it probably was a little overpowered. Yeah. And, and yeah. it probably gives more reason to have other weapons now, other guns. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Okay, so the, the, the metal cubes don't appear to have any use. Like, I can't click on them. They don't have a red border. Right, like, they seem like they should be a tradable item, right? But I get the feeling that they're not just a tradable item. Why would you start with something... Otherworldly engravings. Right? And as far as I know, H.P. Lovecraft is the only Magnetic one that has them. Material. Maybe, all right, maybe you can use them to, like, swap into shrines to not... Take the negative effect. Maybe. there. I do have one theory, but I don't want to spoil it until we use the Necronomicon. Fair enough. Uh, I am going to loot the Necronomicon, because why wouldn't you? Uh, I did get the Abomination. Should Ooh, I use it? Hell yeah! I'm going to use it. Wait. Caitlin McNeil! Oh, no! I was kind of hoping it would be the Native Scout. All right, uh, All right whatever. It's we, fine. We probably should have waited until we had meat. Ah! <laughs> Ah, waiting. <laughs> waiting is for the week. All right, so I have no sanity left. I desperately need to get somewhere. That is the big downside of H.P. Lovecraft. He goes crazy quick. Does he? Good. He starts with, I think, 30 less sanity than everybody else. Everybody else starts at 100. He starts at 70. These metal cubes have got to be useful for something. All right, I'm going to rest here at the camp. Loeb kept himself and folks with empty eyes on something in the distance. Okay, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and rest... No, I, I need to keep resting. Wait, there was an unnatural quietness. We had to do something. Lo muttered something, and then there were fears that the expedition would fail. I, I had a, a very interesting encounter while resting once Did where uh, one of my comrades had a an uplifting speech and gave me more, like, it gave me 40 sanity. That's awesome. Okay. Right? So I... not just bad stuff happens. Okay, this is interesting. So, this is something else new. You can move while overburdened with items. I mean, you could before, but it, it, it... Yeah, but it didn't show you every item with a slash oh. through it. And it still doesn't quite fix the menu issues that we were having last time, where you right. would, like, mount up and it wouldn't automatically move shit over. Um, okay, so so it's it's got a... It's still got a few minor interface issues, which is, which is fine. No big deal. Um, it is, all right, so this time I am going to look at my compass, because maybe they fixed it, who knows. It's telling me to go directly west, so I'm going to go ahead and I have no food <laughs> of any kind. This is going to be interesting. Should we, all right. uh, should we do this in the next episode? I think we should do this in the next episode. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm stuck here. I don't know what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to die. All right. <laughs> Let's do it. It costs more. It costs more points to level guys up. Does it? Getting, yeah, getting, I, I already leveled this guy oh. up once. It costs two now. Oh, that's so smart. Good job, game. All right, so n next time in the archives, we'll explore the rest of what this update has to offer. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you next time. Uh, ooh, wait, 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 wait. I'm on the hill. Wow, there's oh. the golden pyramid. That's good, but I mean, I want to explore a little. Anyway, anyway, we'll see you next time. See you next time. <laughs> <laughs> This is different. They changed a lot of shit. Right? Yeah, that's why I think waiting the uh, the five or so, four or so updates was, oh, yeah. was good. That's a good call.